and your success. In today's video, I wanna give you a very simple, uh, compact, easy uh, success method, something that you can implement in only one week. So I'm gonna call this exercise seven success concepts in seven days. So listen to me, first concept. The first one is the five steps of planning. The first thing that you have to do is to think. Just get a white piece of paper, get a pen and start thinking. That's step number one, thinking what do you want to achieve this week? What do you want to achieve this month? In the next three months, on the, in the following year, what do you want to achieve? Number two, after you know what you want to achieve, you can prioritize which is the most important in your, li in your list. When I talk about prioritize, I'm talking about what is that specific task that is gonna change the result of your week, that is gonna change your day, that is gonna change your life. So prioritize things that are uh, very close to the final outcome, to the final result. So basically, think about what you want to achieve, break it into steps. When you break it into steps, you can, of course, plan it into your agenda, into your daily planner. You can say, well, uh, this list of priorities, I'm gonna do this on Monday, I'm gonna do this on Tuesday, basically the planning. Point number four of the first one is protection. Protection is, a lot of people get, get up to here, but only a few actually protect themselves. Protect is, if I took the time to think, if I took the time to do a list of priorities, if I took the time to put in my agenda, why you are gonna interrupt me? No way, I'm gonna block myself 20 minutes and I'm gonna make sure I am doing what I'm supposed to do. And then the last one is perseverance. Perseverance is maybe on Tuesday, on Wednesday, your energy is low, you don't want to, you don't feel like to spend time here, drop it. Just get your favorite music, just eat your favorite meal, get, get something that changed your state and keep going. So this is the first concept, seven concepts in seven days. This is the first thing that you have to do. Think, plan, and get exactly clear what do you need to execute. Point number two. Point number two is all about the system, okay? Remember that um, everything that works perfect is because there is a system behind. An airplane, that's a very good system. The human body, that's an amazing system. Society is a system. Everything is a system of systems. So, and the opposite, when you see something that is a completely disaster, is because there's no system behind. So in, in, in the second day, I want you to think about your system. And the system includes only two things. It includes your team, basically, the group of people that work with you, and of course, the events, all the milestones, or the, uh, the projects, whatever you have to deliver. So the system is, I think about what do I want to achieve, I, want, I put the list of people that are gonna work with me, and I decide which are the, the points of control, which are the milestones, which are the events, which are the important um, tasks or events that are gonna make sure, are gonna tell me that I'm actually in the right path towards success, okay? Point number three, one of my favorites is called standards, okay? You have to uh, define which are your standards, okay? There's, in life, there's standards for everything. There's standards for health, for uh, financial, for work, for family, relationship. There's a standard for everything. And in here, it is all about becoming a better version of yourself. So in a standards is when you set, you set the, the culture. And here's when you say, I, my, my team, my company is the, is the one that is, uh, we're gonna do more events, or we're gonna sell more tickets, or we're gonna uh, have more uh, new clients, or we're gonna uh, make the clients more loyal. Whatever you want to achieve, you have to create it into a culture. And that it becomes when you set some standards, some rules, some basically some standards of excellence. Simple as that. Define your standards, day three. Day four is your ability to see the big picture, 
okay? What do I mean with this? Just imagine getting a, a piece of paper in which you set in the next 12 months all everything that um, all your income, your expenses, the travel that you're gonna make, the events that you're gonna go, uh, the uh, whatever, you know, everything just um, get used to putting your life into a one year program. And this is what it's gonna give you is the ability to exactly know what's coming. Basically, no surprises. So get all this plan into a big piece of uh, into a big piece of paper and get the big picture. Get the big picture. Number five, basic fundamentals. Okay, basic fundamentals. What do I mean with that? Success is nothing else than the constant execution of basic fundamentals. Okay, there is successful people at the end. What they have is successful routines. That's simple. Successful people, successful routines. Um, people that are not doing good in life, really bad routine. Tell me your routine, tell me your rituals, tell me your habits, I'll tell you exactly how you're doing. So think about which are the basic fundamentals that are gonna allow you to conquer your plan, okay? Now we get into day number six. I want you to do this for seven days. And the first day, you plan, you, you think, you do all your priorities, planning, protection, perseverance. Then day number two, you create your system. Who is in mind in this project with me? Which are the milestones that I have to achieve? Point number three, which are the standards? We are the best. We're gonna be the fastest. We're gonna be the strongest. Get the big picture. Show to your team what's the big picture. Get basic fundamentals. Which are the things that we do every minute, every 10 minutes, every 15 minutes. If we do this at every minute, then we achieve this. Those are the basic fundamentals. Then number six is laser focus. Laser focus. This is probably the most, most, I told you this was important. Getting the big picture is very useful. Basic fundamental is the base of success. Laser focus. We have lost the ability to concentrate for 20 minutes in a specific task. So drop everything. Turn your uh, phone off, close your email, get out of your office for 20 minutes and execute. Laser focus, okay? And the last one, point number seven, is closing the week. Closing the week. What do I mean with this? This is what we call the moment of truth. Why do I, this is one of my favorite parts of the week when I have had a good week and it's really the worst part of the week when I have been fooling around you know whining you know doing things that I'm not supposed to be doing so closing the week is getting your agenda or getting your uh, notebook and reviewing what did you do on Monday what do you do on Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday and then think about out of all these things that I did during the week, 40 hours, 50 hours, now on Friday, which things I should have said no. It's very powerful. This is one of the most uh, powerful learning tools. You close the week, you put everything you did, and which of these things I should have said no. And of course you prepare for the following week, and when you see the same thing, say, hey, no, no now, okay? I always, tell, I always tell people, I tell a lot of my clients, you know, saying no is difficult. So don't say no, say yes, but no now, okay? Oh, Jose, can you do this for me? Yes, but no now, okay? Hey, Jose, can you come to this meeting? Yes, but no now, next week. When you start pushing things, when you start pushing and telling people no, 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 you finally have the time to think, prioritize, Put in your agenda planning, protect it. Yes, but no now. And finally, with perseverance, you achieve success. So listen, seven easy steps to implement in seven days. This is the challenge. I encourage you to put this into action. Don't quit on me on day two. Don't quit on me on day four. Execute this for seven days. If you're really strong, do it for two weeks and send me some feedback. 
because this is very easy, compact, simple to execute. Plan your success.